for your components. becoming Seath and cursing our fates. It was only by having each other that we made it through those horrifying days. We all shared that fate once, including Snow. I won't be able to face it again.
making a triumphant return. <sighs> you again. Wait, can you hear me? I'm giving you a feeling. Buzz off, Hope. He does like to talk, that one. But jeepers, that was some showdown. Didn't go like I thought. How so? Okay, pop quiz. You get a special treat if you can tell me who showed Noel the Oracle Drive recording. I'm guessing you? Boy, I really underestimated the Shadow Hunter. I never expected he'd sabotage the prophecy himself. After you went to all that trouble to set it up, my heart bleeds for you. Hey, don't get me wrong. I didn't want it to go down any more than you. I'm happy it didn't. The world in that prophecy wasn't real. It was just a pretty fake. Like this god of yours, Benevelza. You know he's not omniscient. There are some things even he can't see. Things he can't see? Things like this? Oh, you're sharp as a knife, aren't you? When did you get to know so much about things? Still, I wonder if God knows his servant has our own agenda. You don't know what you're talking about. Are you doing okay, Light? Once upon a time, Noel was one of the leaders. When the Order took the reins of power, he went underground, but he didn't disappear. He worked from the shadows to help keep the peace. If the prophecy in the Oracle Drive is true, then maybe I should have died. That would be the best if it brings out the best possible future for everyone. I'm not so sure about that. The moment you die, you'll have failed in your mission as savior. And that, in turn, means you could not save Noel's soul. What would happen to him then? You're saying those images in the Oracle Drive weren't real? Those scenes where everyone looked so happy and safe? They were no more than just a pretty fake. They were just pictures. There's no way to see into the hearts of the people you saw in them. 